Whatever, you know, South by also features some really creative art installations. Cultural reporter Brittany Flowers checked out something called Meow Wolf today. She's live downtown. Brittany, uh, what is a Meow Wolf? <laughs> okay. I'll explain it, don't worry. Uh, Meow Wolf is an interactive art installation that actually started in my home state of New Mexico. The art collective has since expanded to Nevada and Colorado, and now they have a little taste for people here in Austin. Meow Wolf is known for otherworldly interactive art installations. And for the next few days, South by Southwest attendees get to experience a taste of what the art collective has to offer. The creative producer Jack Delaney says the Meow Wolf team worked on the exhibit for months leading up to South by Southwest. The purpose of this is help to reunite people with their lost um, ideas and reunite them with um, their own subconscious artist ideas. As you walk into the exhibit, you're immersed with lights and sounds. You see detailed islands, sunken junk, and buoys, all with their own story. Each island or sunken junk and buoy had teams of um, people that came together and worked on it collectively. One piece features a city glowing with color. Another has mountains with peepholes that people can look into. And each section has a QR code to learn more about the art piece. There's many miniature worlds that have been built inside each one. And then there's a story that goes along with that. So when you come, make sure to scan all the QR codes because you're going to get this story and narrative as you transport throughout the stream. Coming to South by Southwest was an opportunity for the Meow Wolf team to create like they did before the COVID-19 pandemic. So many people have been working remotely and on Zoom and there's meetings and, and that's not fun to a bunch of creatives. So we were able to come together, work hand in hand in teams and then actually come out and do the install, which has been really fun too. The exhibit is a representation of lost ideas and the creators hope to inspire attendees to think about their creative ideas as well. Oh my gosh, y'all, I spent so much time in there. At first, I kind of just walked through, but then I realized how detailed every little thing was, which is amazing that this, this event is in person again because it's not something that you could experience virtual or online. So truly, it is really nice to be back in person. I'm reporting live from downtown at South by Southwest. I'll send it back to you all. And Brittany, you look like you were very inspired by all of this. It looks amazing. True, definitely. <laughs> well, Brittany Flowers reporting live for us at South by Southwest. Thank you, Brittany. And the film festival lasts until March 19th. Then the music festival will start Monday and run through March 20th.